Hey guys. Hey guys, uh, so... Um, my desktop PC is gone. Like, I was running Windows XP on it, and now it's just gone. It's outside now, it's been raining, so it's been soaked in rain, and also it's dead. Because, as you know, uh, Microsoft has ended its, uh, service. So, yeah. Um, so, I need a new desktop replacement. So instead of buying a desktop, I actually, I also love the PC game now, even though I have a PS3, so I am a console and a PC gamer. I spend my time most every day PC gaming. As you can see, the, I've got a, a controller there. Um, so, um, I'm running Windows 8 actually right now, and I need a PC, I need a, actually a portable PC, so, you know, the obvious answer is, get a laptop. But you see, I spend most of my time in this chair gaming here. But very occasionally, I do have to go somewhere. Not gonna say anything. <laughs> um, I have to go to, let's say, another house and game over there because I can't take. Um, I can't lug my desktop tower with me. But I can put my laptop in a laptop bag and go. So. Um, I'm not running from a desktop PC anymore, which used to be underneath there. But I've got, I'm actually using a laptop actually. So it's on a a laptop uh, cooling pad by Targus, and um, as you can see here, it's connected. It's, I'm connected. Uh, I've connected the VGA cable. I've used Ethernet. Uh, this USB is to connect the cooling pad to. And I don't know if you can hear that, but there are the fans running from the like, uh, cooling pad. And I'm not bothered about noise. I actually can't. I, it's kind of weird, but I actually like the noise of the fans. Uh, uh, post post in the comment section whether you like it or not. The noise of the fans. Just curious to know. <laughs> I've got uh, the speakers connected, and then I've got my power cord over here, and then over there is dark, but it's USB, uh, one USB plugged in, and that hooks up to my uh, USB port in the corner, and uh, that with that USB hub, I've got my Xbox 360 controller, uh, my PC speakers, my mouse, my keyboard, and yeah, that's about it. Yeah. Uh, so I'm running Windows 8, and I do use Steam, and um, everything is normal. Use it as a PC, as you can see, I've got all my just my Steam libraries over there. Uh, but anyways, um. To do this, if you have a laptop, I mean, my laptop, will, you, can, you can still see everything in there, but it's just, uh, what I have then is, if you have Windows 8, you must, you, you'll be able to do this for Windows 7, but you'll just have to find it manually in your power options, but what I like to do is, I just like to type in power options, so you'll find power options. And what you want to do is click that, then you come here, and then it says choose what choose what closing the lid does. So it would be set to um, sleep, but you have to cl click do nothing, do nothing, uh, save changes, and therefore when you close your lid, your laptop lid, your uh, your computer won't shut down. This, this screen won't go off as well because this is still working. It's just that the display on the laptop is shut, and it's just primarily on this. You could, yeah, that's about it. So, um, I do use this for gaming now. Uh, my laptop for gaming, um, and I actually can run. Um, I can run most games on medium, uh, can't run all of them on high, I can only run like one or two, 
but uh, most of them medium. So you know, I I, I think medium graphics are pretty good. No, I, I, I've just come from console, so I think low graphics looks amazing on like that's what I think on PC because I, I'm coming from a console, so I'm not really I've not really seen a GTX um, 780s or whatever it, it is. Uh, but yeah, I've heard uh, they're really good graphics. So um, if you guys if you guys use your laptop and it's powerful enough to become a desktop you wanna do it because at the desktop I had one GB of RAM this laptop's got 8 GB of RAM I mean so this is technically much more slimmer and much more powerful than my old desktop so you know I mean laptops are getting powerful as desktops but you know if, if you guys if you want to use your laptop as a desktop, but also need the portability of a laptop, just do a laptop desktop conversion. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Uh, uh, don't forget to um, comment in the sec in the comment section below, and give me feedback on how the video was. So uh, thank you, you guys, for watching, and I hope to see you soon again.